If you're a golfer, listen up, because this is going to be game-changing. In 2007, there was a study of grip pressure throughout the golf swing. This study by Aaron Schmidt of Lowbury University put sensors on a golf grip and measured the grip pressure of a top-level right-handed professional golfer. The graph you're looking at is the results. The top line is total pressure, the next line down is left-hand pressure, and then the line all the way down at the bottom is right-hand grip pressure. Now there are two key takeaways from the results. The first thing you should notice is how little right hand grip pressure there is. The highest amount of grip pressure from the right hand during the swing is lower than the lowest amount from the left hand. The second takeaway is how the grip pressure from both hands drops rapidly right before impact, hence the phrase release. Literally think letting go without actually letting go. Light bulbs should be going off because in my opinion, this is the closest thing you'll find to a secret in the golf swing. Since most of us are right-handed, it starts to make sense why golf is so dang hard. We have created a training aid to solve this issue. I'm running out of time on this video, but please visit golfsmissingpiece.com to learn more about how to fix this issue in your golf swing. Thank you. Happy golf.